Hello, and welcome to On the Green with Alan. Welcome back for the start of the spring semester. We have many exciting things happening on campus. Nearly 25 years ago, Gallaudet students, faculty, staff, and alumni united to bring change to the university. Until 1988, Gallaudet never had a deaf president. Many people felt it was time for a deaf person to lead the university. The community banded together. Many marched on Capitol Hill, participated in peaceful demonstrations on campus, held rallies, and gave inspirational speeches. This movement was called Deaf President Now, or DPN for short. Many people outside Gallaudet supported the DPN movement and were known as friends. They included civil rights leaders, members of Congress, then Vice President George Bush, and the deaf community at large, including my wife Vicki and me. After eight days, DPN succeeded. Dr. I. King Jordan became the first deaf president of Gallaudet. To honor the 25th anniversary of DPN, Gallaudet is hosting a series of events throughout the semester. The celebration kicks off February 5, 2013, with the President's Panel with Dr. I. King Jordan, Dr. Robert Devilla, and me. We will discuss how DPN transformed the lives of the deaf and hard of hearing community in the United States and how it affected our work as presidents of Gallaudet. Check the Daily Digest and Gallaudet's Facebook and Twitter pages for information about the upcoming events. I'm pleased to announce Dr. Harry Lang, a highly respected educator, author, and leader in the deaf community, will receive an honorary doctorate degree during the 144th commencement in May. Dr. Stephen Chakind, a professor in the Department of Business from 1989 to 2012, will be recognized for his service to the university by receiving Professor Emeritus status. The Bison baseball team recently finished a rigorous three-day training program with the former Navy SEAL. The team performed hours of exercise drills on campus and around D.C., including sprints, push-ups, crunches, sandbag lifts, boat races, and tug-of-war. Coach Curtis Pride set up the training to prepare the team for the upcoming season and to help strengthen their bond. The first game is on February 23, 2013. Go Bison! Regional competitions for the 2013 Academic Bowl for deaf and hard of hearing high school students have begun. The Academic Bowl was established at Gallaudet in 1997. It is a Jeopardy style quiz tournament. Questions are taken from a variety of categories, social studies, language, science, math, the arts, Deaf Studies, Sports, and more. 
Five regional competitions will take place in January and February. The top three teams from each region and one fourth place team will participate in the 17th annual national competition held at Gallaudet March 9th to 12th, 2013. In December, Gallaudet hosted the Battle of the Books for deaf and hard of hearing middle school students. Students were required to read four books and answer questions about them. The Texas School for the Deaf won. Congratulations. One last note. We will celebrate the legacy of Martin Luther King Jr. with the program January 29, 2013 at 12.30 p.m. in Foster Auditorium. Thank you for watching On the Green with Alan.